My name is Archie Jackson. I am uh, head of cybersecurity and technology at an organization, at a multinational organization at, uh, in CEDO. My name is Kevin and I'm 13 years old. I'm currently in grade 8 and I live in India. My work, what I do is completely sitting off uh, the laptop for 16, 18 hours. I never got trained into any sports. I've been a completely uh, a person into studies, books, schools, but not into sports. This is the first time I have tried myself in looking at the aspects of how a human body can go to extremes. I've been sitting onto my desk, working late hours, completely uh, various different aspects around uh, uh, food habits and all. So uh, this is bringing discipline into into uh, my life. How we can, how sports and how martial arts can bring discipline into uh, personal well-being. My reason to come here was for fitness and stamina because I had very bad stamina before I came here. So this is the winter break. So December, January is primarily he's away from school. He's uh, having his leisure time. Now, the point is the options that he have at home is either get onto the PlayStation or mobile or other gaming. So it's again, not, not healthy from, from physical aspects. What I thought was, why don't dad and son go out and try another, something completely different. And this would also bring better discipline, better focus, and uh, it would be a, a memory of lifetime, definitely. The very first day when I came down, uh, it was I was I was very enthusiastic. I mean, very energized. Uh, few wrong kicks had uh, I, I uh, lost my thumbnail. What I learned is uh, the the day I lost my toenail. I was speaking to Nod. I was like, oh, I, I my my toenail is gone. I am feeling a lot of pain. What he he, he told me, no pain, no more Thai. And that was the point I actually uh, gained resilience. It was mental resilience. And I started, I continued with my training from the next day. I, I thought I should take a couple of days off and then come back. But no, uh, no, no, it, it, I continued with the next day training and it actually helped. We, we had our daily meals from uh, breakfast, lunch and dinner all at our cafe. I, I did go around uh, the island. There are good, good, uh, I would say restaurants, but the best one I, I found is again, from uh, the healthy cafe as well, because from every aspect, from the food, the quality, the hygiene, and the way you present that. The, 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 you have the glasses, your, your espresso is in a very beautiful uh, shot glass, and I mean, it actually motivates you to, to eat healthy. I'll be coming down again, uh, to make sure I spend at least over the period of like six to eight months of uh, rigorous training because I want to plan uh, a fight as well. So hopefully one day very soon I'll be on the in, in the ring and uh, my doing my first fight, Moeta fight. One of the key, uh, I would say, uh, message that I would like to share across people who are uh, uh, planning to uh, get trained into Muay Thai or even just thinking around it uh, just kill the fear kill the fear uh, there's nothing to be fear or, or be scared about it's it's just like another training but if you if you have that focus if you have that uh, determination you you can do that if, if I can do it anybody else on this planet can do that hope, hope to see you at punch it gym, gym. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Just hit the bell not to miss any content that we create for you almost every week.